What's up everybody? Welcome back. I'm Ahab and I've got another City Skyline session for you in my city, Liverpool. So in the last session I uh, realized that I could use this area down here as kind of a uh, industry hub for uh, the one-off specialized factories like the toy factory and a refinery uh, and what is this, plastics factory. Um, so I moved everything that was down here that had to do with oil and I basically made this entire area Madison Flats as you can see it's rebuilding um, just moved everything up here it's a little bit more organized and we'll see how that goes I also went a little bit crazy and flattened out this hill over here and put down the cargo hub airport uh, which uh, interesting runway a little up and down there for the cargo folks it looks like it needs some water yep needs some water that should do it Run for a minute. There we go. All right. So while I've got daylight here, and for whatever reason my uh, my ultimate uh, eye candy is not functioning quite well, uh, let's get some rail going into the cargo hub. So I specifically built a tunnel under here. Uh, to flatten out this mountaintop over here and put the cargo hub airport in here. Uh, this would be all sorts of crazy... Uh, this would be like air, like New York, the airspace above this. This, this would not be uh, really well thought out in the real world. But um, it is what it is. Again, sometimes I don't build beautifully. Uh, in this map, it's kind of gone... Uh, not quite as organized as I would have liked, and uh, I could fix it in the long run, but at the same time I'm learning all the new stuff for industries and stuff like that, so uh, let's see here, let's get this I want a branch off of here, and what I'm building here is a branch, Building a branch to connect up to there. All right. Now I'm presuming that all the trains are going to the to here are going to be coming in that direction or coming from this direction. So that is a that is quite the uh, supposition, if you will. something kind of weird there. Uh, let's redo that. There we go. I'm not sure what happened there, but, uh, well. All right, so... I think eventually this is going to be connecting to some industry down here. Uh, oh, actually, that's coming. Yeah, see, that's... <laughs> Oopsie. That's exactly what I didn't want to do. Alright, so basically what I did, so these folks coming here come off from there. Folks coming from this direction will come off here. That's what I was doing. I'm just confusing myself. Happens frequently.
building this railroad here. Actually, this will work out nicely. All right. Come along here. All right, so... And uh, let us... Whoa. Is that... Oh, no, that's, that's true. Oh, well, actually... Oh, no, that's Shadow. All right. Woo. I thought for some reason something got ridiculously flooded down there. And, um... Uh, oh, that's right. I also need to finish building the road. Yes, 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 yes. All right. So, the road... Let's see here. What I wanted to do with the road was... I wanted to split it off into... Something a little unique here. Well, actually, so if I bring it down here, that gives them plenty of areas. All right. For now... What the frick? Is it automatically going to like minus nine? It's a little frustrating, I'm not gonna lie. Alright. that start cranking away this really isn't the smartest way to build this out because that's these are ships coming in to drop stuff off these are going to be airplanes rail way too many airplanes in my airspace this for a minute and see what happens. Oh, hey, all right. We've got trucks going to the uh, cargo hub over here. Something I need to do is just clear out some of these trees. We all know that, really, there are no trees in an airport, or at least around the runways. Certainly, there's not going to be power lines there. <laughs> so it looks like I need to do a bunch of cleanup here. There we go. Hey, cargo. Oh, it's an Antonov. That's a large uh, cargo plane in real life. but this is one of the smaller detail things that I like to do is just clear out 
space around airfields and airports. You know, because you can't have trees right up to a runway. You got the, the wings of the airplanes going over the runways. I know that doesn't, it doesn't really matter in this particular game, but there's just something about me that I feel the need to do this. trucks everywhere. Yeah, see, I did it. I did it for the international airport, too. Let's slow things down. I'm going to put these here. At least what I can do is delete this malarkey. Holy cow. Cargo planes are piling up on each other. So what kind of stuff we got going in here? We've got uh, copper company. We've got mail. We've got hot dog trucks coming out. I mean, this is just this is just crazy. Uh oh. No power. So that's got all sorts of plastics, but it's not getting petroleum. Oh, and I guess the refinery... ...is not getting anything either. Curious. What? Sorry about that. I'm back. A couple days later, had to take an important phone call and uh, cut the previous session off. And uh, since uh, since cutting off that session, uh, definitely moved forward on a couple of other uh, episodes that uh, will be coming out uh, shortly after this one, um, addressing, uh, well, how I turned Madison Flats into five stars instead of two like it was previously. Uh-oh. Something was on fire there, isn't it? Oh, that's not on fire. That means something else. Yeah, Madison Flats is five stars. Uh, did some new ores area work. Um, but I'm a little frustrated by how the Cargo Hub airport's laid out. What I mean by that is, is this elevation change, I think, is preventing... I think is preventing these other cargo areas from working. Now, I could be wrong about that. Let me just do a quick... Quick... Google foo on that. Back. 
All right, I'm back, and um, while I am frustrated, uh, it is similar in that it's only one path in, one path out. Which, to me, is using uh, another term, a little load of uh, BS for something that's supposed to be a cargo hub. And now that I'm looking at the path, uh, this path needs to be changed because I can't have these. All right, so let us swap this out. Uh, delete, 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 delete. And I really don't need six lanes coming up. So what I'm actually gonna do is Yeah, I'm gonna change this up completely. Alright, so get rid of that. All these guys are gonna have to do is come up in here, make it a lovely two lane road. You're straight, so that's fine. Uh, no. Let's try to keep this kind of act here. Alright, that should do there. Uh, I'm going to... Wondering if... Yeah, you know what I'll do here is I'm gonna make a... Oh, no, no, that's not what I want. That quick. So what I want to do here is I want... Damn it, I did the same thing. <laughs> uh, I want to... Alright, so we've got that. And then... I want to make it so that... These folks can... Come in and make a... You, uh, a right turn only, basically. So if they want to go right up to the ports, they can do that, or they can come down and do this. Uh, so then I will use traffic. Actually, I need to float up, and then I also need to connect. So what we'll do here is I am going to build a sponge, because that's what cargo requires. Yep, all right. Build one more sponge type item here. There we are. All right. Kind of ridiculous looking, but I also wanted to leave some space in case I wanted to build something up here for the heck of it. And let's let that update. Paths. Oh, all the trucks appear and have to go a different direction now. Okay. All right, now let's do some pathing. Traffic management. Right. That lane. This one. Right. This one, you have to go left. It's automatic. And I think what I'm going to try here is just deleting these lights. Lights there. All right. So. 
And what I will do is these guys have to yield. These guys have to yield if there's anybody coming, and that should do it. Speed the sucker up. See if that helps a little bit with uh, traffic going to and fro this bad. Because what was happening was I had traffic coming in from this side. And they go in. Yep. Yeah, so see they go in. They go in the cargo hole on the right. And they come out the cargo hole on the left. And with the cars coming in from the left, it's blocking in an, the out. Uh, and thus just causing all sorts of issues. So, that should be that. Hopefully that's a little bit of a better flow. And I wonder how many people should be going right. I doubt we'll see anybody making a right to go to the port area. Although, I don't know, maybe in the future I'll have some industry here to do something. So maybe we'll see some back and forth. All right, well, let's uh, date that side of things. Uh, I want you to keep moving. Because, realistically, there should be not many people. I presume putting in that Putting in that airline, putting in the air cargo hub is just going to take a lot of traffic away from the port. So that means I can build more industry. Yay! Oh, I guess we won. Win? Uh, yeah, I won last year. <laughs> A dead person at the stadium is waiting for transport. Oy vey. Oh, wow. Yeah, this is a traffic area I'm going to have to work on. Okay. Let's see. How is industry doing here? So, what's going on here? Oh, you are probably full on... Stuff. Oh no, you're producing nothing. Why are you producing nothing? Not offer not enough buyers for product. Oh. Well, not enough buyers for product because. Products. Oh, that's right. I didn't change that guy. Change this one to. Nope, that's generic. This is plastics. That's petroleum. Petroleum. It's doing you. You are chock-a-block full of storage. And how are you guys doing? You guys look like you're having a grand old time. Oh, see this? This is the same thing. For some reason, this one just runs better than the air one. Curious. Well, there is a solution for that. Quick. Let's upgrade all these roads. Actually, pause this. I know it doesn't seem like much, but said in an earlier episode, maybe it's just an earlier recording that hasn't been released as an episode yet, I really want things to run efficiently. So <laughs> it's going to take a minute for this to get cleared up, but um, you know, if, if the in, if the out is getting blocked by people coming in, I mean, that's just, you know, that, that, that's... That's an issue. All right. 
like. Alright, and the stream has started again. Excellent. Alright. And you can see uh, the refinery has uh, started producing some good stuff here. Uh, and uh, the plastics, the household plastic factory has been doing occasional work, uh, but I just don't have, apparently I don't have the petroleum or the plastics production. So let's put in a more, a couple more things here. So I know I've got plenty of barrels of petroleum storage. building. What is, let's just check on Madison Flats for a second. Let's see what's going on. So we've got five hundred and thirty five barrels efficiency is fifty one percent pollution is forty percent. So let's uh minus forty percent. Let's do a couple of things here. Let's see here. That's where the barracks are. Lots more barracks. Oh no, the, these are the barracks. I want to build. I want to build the barracks and stuff away from areas where, like, this is all oil production in here. So I want to build the barracks away from where production is. So we will let's see one, two. So that's an additional twenty percent of efficiency theoretically. Uh which I think I did I didn't I put a couple yeah right there. Ah, uh, see, so that's an issue. If I put... Alright. Let's see. Let us... These guys up. Production here. Right, and then... NAFTA Cracker makes plastics, right? Plastic, yes. So, these guys. Here. And, just oil. Petrochemical, this guy makes 4,000 units a week. This guy makes. Oh. It's... No, petrochemicals plastic, so this is. Put another. Something right. All right. Well, that's some more production to the oil facility, and it's again, for whatever reason, there's only. There's only nine trash trucks for this entire industrial side of things, which is just just kind of crazy to me. Um, let's see here. Just take a check on everything. Oh, that's one thing I did want to do. 
I haven't connected the outside line to my freight rail. And frankly, that's kind of something I wanted to keep separate. Um, yeah, actually, what I can do, though, is... I think I'm going to have to create a... No, because I, I... Let's see, what does this look like? So this is starting to get backed up here. Let us... Time for some... Let's see if we can give a little bit of a slip lane here. Yes. Yes, we can. Alright, and then just make sure that these guys aren't nuts. Go there, there. 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 Alright, now I've got to do something about this guy, because this is just getting... This is just getting... Alright, so... Here and do this one there. You can go there. There. You not go right. That is just not. There. There. And. Alright. Going on. This is just a. Giant snafu of sorts. Well, I think this is something I'm going to have to uh, look further into. But it looks like... Looks like I cleared up that backup a little bit. Maybe that was just one-off because... Uh, of like a rush hour or something. I don't have real-time traffic mods, so it's not like it's going to build up because of an event or something like that. This is just pure industry, ridiculous traffic. Garbage is piling up. It's piling up. Now, is it piling? No, that's two way. It's two way, isn't it? That's one way. But that is two way. It's two way. That's two way. Those guys can come in there. 
So I really don't understand. What is Oh, that's something else I was going to do. I'm thinking about it, and I want to add toll lanes, people coming in and out of the city. Because you know what? You used my roads. Yes. Yes, indeed. All right. So let's just do that because diabolical. Camera. Definitely make this closer to slope. Slope is the death of me on this map. Just it is so random and hidden. Build some high. All right. Now we will use move it. And would like some some higher some more and I need to get more more road options is what I need. Alright. Give these guys some more options here. All right. Oh. Water? Which I can get from the airport. All the way over here. Come water. We need power. Which again, I will take from the airport. Cars one dollar, trucks dollars. It doesn't seem bad for now. Leave it at that. All right, so that's one. And let me see here. There's another one. 
This one I have to be careful about because I want to do here. I want to build a f this highway. Because that is kind of low. Do that in a minute. Let's this again. Some toll lanes. What I was saying is I gotta be careful here because this is all sorts of weird elevation because of the on ramp off ramp situation I've got here. And tolls. Oh, so that is... It's that way. It's that way. Second, R, 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 it. It's a little bit, and yeah, just a little bit. This one. That's better. Ten. To get some water down here. This is like miles from. So I'm just going to follow the highway. Similarly, actually, this, this I might have to do just a wind. It's even out. So, four minutes, four minutes. I wonder if that'll be enough. Let's check. Say power one hundred and sixty kilowatts. So that's less than one megawatt. So if you bump it up to one, that's two megawatts per toll booth. We should be good there. Hey, or it's upgraded again. All right, that's that area, and don't really have a space here, so that was a on ramp, off ramp that I manually had to make because the hill here and there. Kind of neat. Ugly as hell. Really would like to redo that so it's much more attractive, but um, that's something I'll worry about later. All right. Um, I think that's enough for this episode. Thanks all for joining me. If you have any comments, requests, or recommended YouTubers for me to check out, go ahead and leave them in the comments. Uh, otherwise, I hope you all have a good one and hope to see you again. Bye-bye.